Welcome back graduates. Today I'm going to show you something really pretty cool. It's called value props. At the same time, it's also called, called trust badges. Uh, now the reason why people have customers like seeing this is because it gives a little sneak peek and snippet on to as to what your business is about you know right over here on my coffee brand it's saying free shipping on all orders you know it's 100 percent protected payments and it's trusted by 50,000 users now that might not be but um it's it's good to show it, it gives a little value and it gives a little more trust to your store this is displayed on all product pages um underneath the add to cart or buy now button just like this as well um this this um, code you know we've written for you it's very simple and easy um copy and paste um but if you do need uh help we do have an installation as well for you um so let's get right to it three two one here we go so what you're going to do is you're going to go into the back end of your Shopify store and you're going to be given um, a file, you know, the file that you have always gotten before when purchasing your snippets, the HTML file, and then also the actual section itself. So this is what it's going to look like. Um, now, we also um, noticed that Dawn has released a 6.0 and a 6.01 version. Uh, so when we write our snippets, we like to do them on the latest version because that way, if it works on the latest version, it works on the uh, previous versions as well. So with that being said, it does work on 4 and it works on 3. It works on all the versions that you've seen. Now, if you, here's a little... Um, nugget here now if you are on a 4.0 or you know earlier than a 6 um scroll down here and this is what's going to allow you and this is what's going to say it's going to notify you that there's a dawn version 6.0.2 available and what you can do is just you know add this to theme library and then you'll have the latest uh dawn theme so it's going to give you that notification right here if you're not on the latest version or if there is a latest version for you to update when that does when you do click on that it's going to just you know show up right here right here so what i'm going to do is i'm going to show you that in real time i'm just going to get the free theme this works on all the other free themes as well but we like dawn a lot so we're just going to do this for dawn and right now you see it is being installed. This is showing that there is uh, no snippets involved. I just want to show you that it does work um, and how to set it up and, and everything. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go into the edit code of that new theme that has no, um, no snippets. I'm going to go to my readme file that you're, be, that you're going to be uh, given in that zip. And under footer, so the first thing it says is go and open your theme.liquid and under footer, add this section. So I'm just gonna copy and paste that section into my code. So this is the new one that I just uploaded. I'm gonna go into theme.liquid and I'm gonna scroll, you can scroll all the way down or you can type in uh, search, control F um, and type in footer. So I'm just gonna paste that right there. So it's gonna look like that. Then the next step, the only last step I have to do is take that uh, section and I will edit that, but I but create a section right over here, new section and name it exactly as how you wrote it in the eg in the uh, theme dot liquid. So eg trust the ag badges. Now what I'm going to do is take my file here. I'm going to open the RTF file. I'm going to open that. Close out of that. I don't need that anymore. And I'm just going to paste that and save. So now what I want to so now what I want to do is click customize. And once I'm in here, it's going to look pretty pretty clean and similar. What I want to do is scroll at the very bottom here where it says EG trust badges, and this is where it's going to be. Uh, those are, that's where the settings are going to be placed. Um, I'm just going to go to a product page so I can see it in action right over here scroll all the way down to an edit and sometimes I don't know why Dawn does that glitches out like that so scrolling down here I'm gonna add from my sections a block I'm gonna add three blocks and we give you by default um, in placeholder just this 
So you know what it looks like and I'm just going to click save. And now it's going to, so once I click save, it's going to um, populate right over here. And we gave placeholders like this. So what you want to do is go into here and you can change out the text uh, here. And then you can change out the SVG. You can have your own custom SVG or you can go and uh, get, you know, free uh, SVGs from this library right here where I just clicked. So once I'm in here, I'm just going to scroll and I'm going to find, let's say I want to find um, this heart. So I'm just going to take this heart. I'm going to download this heart and I want to download this. So once I open this, it's going to give me this tiny little icon here. And what I'm going to do is inspect element. And what you're going to see is this. So what I want to do is I just want to click the SVG and I'm going to do edit HTML. When I edit HTML, it's going to give me this string right here of SVG. That's the code I want. And I'm just going to copy and I'm going to paste it right into the, the, seg the segment right here, the section. So I'm going to paste this and then I'm going to save. And once I save that, you'll notice that it's small. It's pretty small, un unlike the other ones. When I go into the second block here, you'll notice that the width and the height are 30. And that's the size I want to keep consistent with all my icons. So I'm going to go back to the first one and just change out 16 to 30. I'm going to save it and then see the change here. I don't know why Don does that sometimes. But there you go. Now it's the same size um, using that awesome clean SVG and then change out text. I can say um, from loving customers or uh, whatever text you want. This is, you know, you want to give three value, um, value bombs or not value bombs, but three value uh, reasons why they should come to your store. You know, um, loving customers, um, fast support. Um, Anything like that, you know, this is a place to, to put them right here. And then you have a boatload of icons as well to choose from. Which is, um, you can even have a cart here and easy, simple checkout, things like that. Uh, so if you haven't subscribed, uh, please like and subscribe to this, uh, to this channel. We really appreciate it. It helps with the YouTube algorithm. It does. And then we can, you know, show more videos like this. If you have any comments, um, please comment down to the, you know, comment section below. Um, if you want more videos like this and want more how to's, definitely leave a comment as well. Thank you so much. And I hope this works out really well for you. Thanks.